Calajuri is the author of Get a Life, Not a Job in today's Reclaim Your Career. Uh, we're going to talk about why investing in your skills through training or education can make all the difference in the world, especially in this economy, Paula. Investing in your skills means a lot of things, though. It, it sure does. And investing in the right set of skills, right? You know, the, the president mentioned those STEM areas, science, technology, engineering, math, but also advanced, uh, advanced uh, manufacturing, areas in skilled trades, some areas of education and health care. All of those are very important right now. 52% of companies are saying they're having a difficult time filling those positions. Mm. So real important, real important to think about those, those fields. So then once you isolate, isolate that field, then you have to figure out what kind of programs are available that kind of correspond with that field and give you that edge in training. Right. And, and keep in mind, friend, not all training programs are created equal. Just because a program has the same course title does not mean it will give you the same benefit for your career. Mm -hmm. So real important here, think about getting to the best possible program with the best reputation. Those will be the ones that will be training you on cutting edge skills. They're going to have the best network and they're going to be the feeder for employers. So even though another program might be convenient, you want to stick with the program with the best reputation. And then what do you mean investigate uh, placement rates for these programs? Right. Leading programs are happy to tell you about their placement rate. They're happy to tell you what companies come on campus to interview their mm. students, what companies hire their students. My concern is that periodically these programs that might not be leading programs, they're happy to tell you about anecdotes of certain uh, graduates. If they're telling you anecdotes but not telling you about placement rates, that should be sending up a red flag. So something to consider. Be sure you keep digging for great information on placement rates and then get advice uh, from leaders on training on programs on all the options right if you're currently working this is a really nice opportunity to talk to your your senior leaders in your organization or people who are in the functional areas um, that you're interested in moving into first of all it'll, it'll signal to them that you're dedicated to the company you're also dedicated to advancing your career this is great things to be signaling especially in this economy um, if you're currently unemployed you can ask for advice uh, with people who are in the field you can look for people who are successful locally and really talk to them about how to and what those best programs might be. You can also go online and check out some websites. Uh, professional organizations will be, you know, usually do have great lists of the reputable programs or accredited programs. So great opportunities, but make sure you ask or certainly do your research online. All right, Polly Calajuri, thanks so much. Always good to see you. I appreciate that. My pleasure. All right, folks down in Florida can't wash their car.